Hey everyone, it's Word on Wednesday time and we are looking at one verse today from the scripture we are in, Proverbs chapter 18 and it's Proverbs chapter 18 verse 9 and our phrase today is Proverbs 18 9, are we really trying? Are we really trying? This is a question because the scripture today has to do with the whole area of slackness and laziness and I know that we've been in a prescribed dare I say lazy time with the lockdown um, I know many of you have been frontline workers and I know many of you have kept busy with family and all that's been going on but for some um, it has kind of got them into a bad habit of laziness and uh, that may or may not apply to you uh, but even overarching that and over and above all this there is the way that we approach life and there is the way that we approach what we do in life and so Proverbs 18 verse 9 says one who is slack in his work is a brother to one who destroys fairly serious there isn't it um going to read from a couple of other versions the new living translation says a lazy person is as bad as someone who destroys things. And then the contemporary English version says, being lazy is no different from being, from being a troublemaker. And so it just very simply got me thinking around the areas in my life that I have responsibility to and for, that I'm a bit slack in. And do I realize that when I apply myself lazily or with a degree of slackness to that which I have responsibility for, that I am a brother to someone who destroys. Um, I have been made and you've been made to be part of the building up of the kingdom of God. And so we are part of a building program, not a destruction program. The destruction program is the enemy's mandate. Uh, but Jesus has come to give us life and we're part of a, a building up the kingdom program. And the enemy his role uh, for his life, poor thing, is to steal, kill and destroy. Um, but whenever I'm slack or whenever I am lazy, I am a brother to someone who destroys. I don't want to be a brother to the destroyer and I don't want to be a brother to anyone who destroys. I want to be part of that which is built up, that which is of God, that which is going to have a lasting impact that which is going to have fruit that will expand God's kingdom and bless people and cause people to look to Jesus and be connected to God in a new way that's what I want to be a part of and so very simply today I'm just asking myself and I'm I'm asking you is there an area of your life where you know you're meant to be responsible and you know you're called to work hard and to put yourself in a hundred percent but that you are slack at the moment or indeed is there an area of your life where you could be found guilty of being lazy this could have something to do with a relationship that you're in with a marriage with parenting with being a child of a parent with being in a workplace be it your home or an office or a factory or as part of the bin collection or in a building site whatever it is whatever place you have in life are you applying yourself diligently are you doing it with all of your heart and are you an, an example in the way that you do your doing so a very simple word today and one that please God gives us time to ponder and to think about whether we're really trying or not and it's from Proverbs 18 verse 9 and it's challenging us to look at whether or not we are slack or lazy and then saying, if we are so, are we happy to be considered in the company of those that destroy? If we can do something about it and repent and get stuck in with whatever God has given us to do, then praise the Lord, there are great days ahead where we will see the creator being our brother and moving away from being a brother of the destroyer. And so I love you. Be blessed this day. And let's go forward stronger than ever as we build up, work diligently and we give ourselves wholeheartedly to all that God has called us to be and to do in Jesus name. Amen. God bless you guys. Love you.